guys, today we're going to do another cooking video for you guys. This is going to be Crock-Pot Cheesy Chicken Panini. And I will actually put the recipe below in the information box for you guys that want to make this. But the very first thing that you're going to do is um, you're going to put your chicken in your Crock-Pot. Make sure you're, it's unthawed. Um, you're going to need chicken. You're going to need some pepper. You're going to need chicken broth. You're going to need a box of panini. You're going to need two cream of chicken soups. And you're also going to need some sour cream and some shredded cheese. Now, you can put, like, onion in here if you'd like to. You can put some chopped mushrooms in here if you want to. Instead of using chopped mushrooms, if you want to use a can of cream of chicken and a can of cream of mushroom, then you could do that. But we don't really like mushrooms, so I'm just using cream of chicken, and I'm not going to put any mushrooms in this. But um, you could put whatever you want in here. Like I said, I'm not even going to put an onion in here because they don't like onion either. First thing you're going to do is you're going to take your cream of chicken soup and you're going to pour both cans in your crock pot. Okay, the next thing you're going to do is after you've got your cream of chicken in there, you're going to add one cup of chicken broth to this. Then I'm just going to take some of this cracked black pepper and put some of that in here as well. Now I'm just going to take a whisk and I'm going to whisk all of this together until it is like a pretty smooth consistency. Okay, that's pretty good. That's what we have there. Now I'm going to open my chicken and I'm going to place it on top of the sauce. Okay, now I'm going to turn it on low and I'm going to cook it in here for six hours. Now when you're cooking it, you do not want to take the lid off whatsoever. You do not need to turn the chicken. Just let it cook for six hours on low. After this cooks on half or on low for six hours, there's really not much else to it other than adding the cup of sour cream, the cup of cheese, shredding the chicken, stirring together, adding the cooked noodles, stirring together, and then sprinkling the top with cheese, covering it back up, letting it cook 20 more minutes, and it's done. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, and then, yeah, I'll show you guys the finished product once it's done. It's really, really super good. The recipe and the directions and everything will be linked below. Um, I'll put in the recipe and stuff is, um, like, if you guys want to add chopped mushrooms and things like that, um, I'll put that down there if you guys want to follow that one because I know a lot of people probably do like mushrooms. But anyway, that's, that's, how, that's how we make it. Okay, guys, that pretty much does it. This is the finished product. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you make it, and I wish you guys a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and I'll see you guys again in my next video.